Hi, good morning, folks. Uh, in this tutorial, uh, I will show you how you can get rid of some of these uh, icons and uh, uh, widgets that you have here after you install Windows 11. I will also show you how you can also uh, either show some of these icons or just get rid of them. And uh, finally, I will show you how you can correct this one here. Uh, this little icon, which is the security of your computer, it has a little uh, yellow triangle on top of it, which means uh, there's a problem with your computer. So I'll show you how to uh, to get that. First, let's start with this uh, with this icon here on the screen. So you have a few of them. Uh, one of which is the is the widget here. Uh, you know, especially about this one is especially about the temperature. But look what happens when you click on it. All you have is you know those this politics and you know, all these articles, which to me, I do not watch any of this uh, or read any of this. Um, so how do you get rid of that easily? Um, just, just right click and select taskbar setting here. After you select that one, come here and you will see the word widget and that's where you have to turn it off. And you can see it disappears after I turn it off, it just disappears, okay? Now, second step is this search bar here. This, what is the purpose of this search bar? Okay, uh, let's say you're looking for something in your computer that you want to find, right? Um, let's say, for example, I'm just going to type OneDrive. And the minute I type OneDrive, if I'm looking for that application, it will show me here the option that, you know, this is the best match. And as you can see, it, it is installed on my computer. All right. Now, uh, there's also um, folders, the option to the folders, right? I, if I click here, it's going to take me straight into my folder or where my uh, one uh, drive uh, folders are located and also eventually uh, it will take me if I, if nothing is found here it will take me to the internet and find it that's basically so you can search both your computer and on the internet as well um i personally do not like to have this space occupied here by a long uh by this long uh space so what i normally do i you know i click on the start and you're gonna have the exactly the same results right look at it so if you click here you're gonna have basically the same results the same uh the same search bar to look for information so how do you get rid of that one uh again i'm just gonna right click taskbar setting remember search here on the top hide and it's gone now um there's other uh icons here uh, for example the task view the task view if you have like many tabs open you can actually sit them separately and select the one you want right um, I only have one open. That's why it only uh, one is only displayed. How do you get rid of that? You can just click off here as well. Same for chat. This one, this application here, you get rid of it. That's it. Now, the question is, well, I used to have this on the left side when I used Windows uh, 10 or Windows 7. How do I get them to the right? Very easy. Right click, task setting. And then there's an option here. It says taskbar behavior. So in the taskbar behavior, you have here uh, the alignment. So select left, and it's going to go to the extreme left. And to me, this is my, prefer my preferred uh, style. And the reason is because I have some other icon here on the right that are not visible. And if I have plenty of space here, how to, uh, to put it here on this taskbar here, right? Okay, so let's, uh, how do I get this uh, over here? Easy. Um, let's close again, right click, taskbar setting, and then you select the system other system um tray icons all right so as you can see only one drive is visible here but you can i can make them all visible if i want to okay this is one way to do it or for example let me just uh, revert to changes let's say i want to i want to put it back in uh, up to the right i just go here move it here down and drop it Right, it's the same. It's the same way as if you do it like that. I mean, you do it the way you want. You want it. Uh, it's the way it's easier for you. Okay, so I have all the icons there. Now, um, how do I get rid of this uh, this little uh, yellow triangle, which it's telling me you have a security? Well, when you install Windows, uh, the first thing Microsoft wants you to do is uh, set up OneDrive. I do have OneDrive in this computer. That's another video. Uh, I will set it up, but I don't want to do it right now, so I'm just going to dismiss it and it turned into green. Now, this is important, application and browser control. It's important that uh, that your uh, browser, either 
uh, Google Chrome or Edge or Mozilla, whatever uh, browser you have, it's important to, uh, to block potential unwanted applications. In this case, I'm going to turn it on, right? And as you can see now, my computer is protected. That's a check mark here. Um, that's all I have for today, folks. So if you like my uh, tutorial, please give me a like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you and have yourself a great day.